Okay, I'm going to show you what I would do in this case. So let's just say that there are a group of students that I wanted to um, make this particular test that is located in Blackboard available to. Um, and that's to the exclusion of all others. So what I've done is I've actually come over beside the title of the test and I click the little drop down arrow and I'm looking for something that is called adaptive release. So I'm going to go select that right now. The type of adaptive release that I want to employ in this case is to allow only certain users to access the test. So for instance, let's say I wanted Danny Greer to be able to access the test. All right. Uh, I know it's D. Greer. There we go. There he is. And so I'm going to go ahead and submit. Okay, so let's just say I just want it to be open to Danny. So I go ahead and submit. And now what you can see is that only certain people have access to it because adaptive release is turned on. So I could even test this out right now because I didn't put my preview user into this uh, space where they have access to the test. So I'll flip it into my preview user. And now I'm going to go down to aircraft maintenance, click on that spot, and there is no test for me to access here. So other students in this course will be unable to see that this test exists. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to exit preview. And again, the area that I was in was aircraft maintenance. Back in that space, you can see that in fact the test is located there. 